That's my yacht. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sank it. Made me seasick. That's me dabbing on my tank. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sold it online. Those are my cool sneakers. That's my wolf. Those are my really cool sneakers. You've got a wolf? Canyon. He was like a brother to me. A brother who didn't wear pants. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it is an honor to be your friend, Daniel. Do you still have it? Whoa! Ah! Wow! Ah! It's him! I can feel it! <laughs> um, are you sure he'll remember you? Nobody forgets Eriko Platana! What's up, Canyon? Where's Daddy's big old wolfy wolf? You all right, Erico? It's fine. It's all good. This is just how we greet each other in the pack. Are you sure you're friends? Of course I'm sure. Relax. I can't wait to take him back to your place. <laughs> You sure he's house trained? He's just getting his bearings. It's completely normal. What? Daniel, we said no animals in the house. You've got ten. I'll pretend I didn't see anything to get rid of it. One, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Two, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Is that a dog I hear? You know that's against the rules. We'll talk about it later. Bye! Maybe he can stay a little longer. <laughs> Did you hear that, Canyon? My best bud! I thought I was your best friend! Love Canyon, but uh, don't you think he's kind of uh, aggressive? You don't get it because you're not part of the pack, Daniel. Well, then, how come I'm always the one cleaning up his fur, cooking his food, and changing his litter box? Yeah, sorry, Daniel. Alpha males don't do that kind of work. <laughs> hey! Cool it, Mr. Canyon! I'm the one paying for your food with my own pocket money, you know! What up? <laughs> Headlowered, ears flattened. With this posture, the wolf shows his submission to the new alpha male. <laughs> Wait till you hear this. Canyon buried me in the garden again. <laughs> Can you believe it? You big bad wolf. Oh no, the bus! We're gonna be late for practice! Whoa. I like his smell. He smells like cinnamon! And torment. <laughs> Whatever. He's just a dog. <laughs>
Okay, kids, back to practice. Yay! Bye, Daniel. Bye, Canyon. See you tomorrow, guys. Hey, nobody forgets Erico Platana. I had to come by foot. By foot! Yeah! <laughs> oh, come on! Night, Canyon. Is he wearing a sweater with your face on it? <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. He's wild and free. Whatever. I understand Canyon much better than you do. They even call me the Wolf Child. Wolf Child. Me and Canyon, we're in the same pack. No bond is stronger than that. We'll see who he likes best. Here, Canyon. Come here, come here. Canyon. Canyon. You like me better than Daniel. Canyon! You like me better than that mean old soccer ball. You like <laughs> me better. Who's gonna be the cutest wolf in the world? Canyon! 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 <laughs> it's so obvious he likes me better. No way! So wrong! I'm taking Canyon for the weekend. We're going to the zoo for some male bonding. What? But it's my turn! We're invited to the neighbor's dog's birthday party! I think there's a little something going on between those two. Canyon would rather go to the zoo! You gave him... <laughs> you gave him cotton candy? How many times... <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you he's allergic? Baloney he loves the stuff. <laughs> He really doesn't seem well. Should we call someone? Shame on you. What did you do to this poor hound? His chakras are blocked, his eyes are lifeless, and his hair is falling out. Like me. I can donate some of my facial hair. Once I actually grow some. Aww. This wolf needs a change. I'll take him to the park. And I'll take him to Ibiza. Jet skiing, all inclusive. Look, Daniel. That's no life for a wolf. He's meant to be with his own kind. Oh. In the wild. <laughs> Maple's right! <laughs> Sorry, Canyon! <laughs> Come on, he's totally fine. And if you don't want him anymore, I'll keep him. Look! You can see he's unhappy. No, oh, even as a cop, he was jealous of my convertible. That's us in the emergency room. He refused to let go of my leg. You were already inseparable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think you're right, Daniel. The time has come for my best friend to go back to his first love. 
Mother Nature. Go on, Canyon. Go back to the great open spaces of the wild. I'll always be there for you. Even if I'm only your second best friend. If Canyon goes, you might get back to the top of the list. <laughs> That's my Daniel! Go on, you're almost there! Most? Are you kidding me? Nice job, Hazelnuts. If we play like that tomorrow, we'll really show Mr. Maslovich a thing or two. Mr. Maslovich? Mr. Maslovich? The scout for the Premier League? That guy's the most influential person in the biz. If he asks you inside the limo, jackpot! But if he kicks you to the curb, it's over. This is the chance of a the chance of a lifetime! Not yet. If Mr. Maslovich sees Daniel now, his career is dead in the water. He'll never be a football star and I'll never get my body back! Unlike the hare, rabbits live in groups and dig burrows that... I need a plan. Maslovich must never see Daniel play. You see that, Erico? <laughs> Buddies are eating the football field. Not now, Daniel. Ruining the football field. Yes, but how? They're saying rabbits can eat three times their own body weight in grass. Not now, Daniel. Eat the grass. That's it. But who would do that? They're calling rabbits the plague of the pitch, the terror of the turf. Hold on, Daniel. Rabbits. Rabbits? That's the answer! I'm a genius! Hazelnuts, we must fix the field before Mr. Maslovich shows up. It's about time. I called you guys over five minutes ago. Stop! Don't you hurt them! <clears throat> they belong here, too! Mm -hmm. Hands off the groundhogs! Rabbits, Dad. The rabbits. Hmm. Okay. Yay! Yay! We did it, Hazelnuts! The people's voice has been heard! Hang on! We may have won this time, but they'll be back. We need to form a resistance. Yellow? Mom, you should sit down. I've got some heavy, heavy news. Did you trip over your laces again? You want the boo-boo song? 
I'm not coming home tonight, Mom. The team needs me here to save the rabbits' lives. I don't know when I'll be back, but I know when duty calls. Okay, so which cuddly toy do you want me to bring over? Friends, my toys, rabbits, and marshmallows. This is heaven, Erico. This huh? is heaven? Oh, yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo Rastafari. This is a nightmare, Daniel. Mm -hmm. Everyone's running around barefoot and the field is wrecked. That's okay. It'll grow back. Oh, yeah? What about my body? Will my body grow back, too? How are you going to practice? You know, Erico, there's more to life than football. Ah, I think you made a new friend. Let me do it. Thank you. No! You shouldn't tickle Snowball's belly there. She hates that. Let me do it. Hmm. No! You have to brush top to bottom, otherwise Thumper doesn't like it. Let me do it. No! Let me do it. No! Let me do it! No, Daniel! We've got a real bond, Jeremy and I. It's not Jeremy, it's Thumper! Okay. Hmm. I've had it! Daniel won't let anyone do anything. Yeah! yeah. He even made Steven cry. Hmm? <laughs> Jeremy! It's okay, it's just my allergies. We need to do something. Yeah! <laughs> Get off my back! Hmm? Settle down, Hazelnuts. If we simply open our minds, Mother Nature will tell us what to do. Give up on Daniel! That'll teach him! Huh? Well, this one didn't take long. You're all leaving? What about the rabbits? You leave us no choice! You're hogging the rabbits, Sisu? You... You, Jeremy! <laughs> what? Don't worry, Chestnut. We don't need any of them. Just you, me, and Erico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just the one kid. I'll bring a big cage. They're multiplying like... like... No! Well, like rabbits. You ratted us out, Erico! Yeah, I'll call you back. How could you do that to Ginger? And to Patches! And to Cinnabon! And to Snowball! And to Roger! Oh, wait. That one's Fiona. I always get that mixed up. <laughs> Since these rabbits arrived, you've forgotten something, Daniel. My curse! Getting my body back! Getting my life back! My curse! It's always about you, Erico. Forget it! You've really let us down. <laughs> Listen up. Our enemy will be here soon. But together, we are more than just a group. My fellow bunnies, we're a whole army! Hmm? No one takes these bunnies as long as I'm here. Hmm, okay. Here you go. This is all my fault, Erico. I'm the reason the hazelnuts all left. The rabbits had to go, Daniel. Practice comes first. How else am I going to get my body back? <laughs> Floppy!
<laughs> it's it's over, Daniel. We've lost. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Guys, you came back. The little people always conquer, Daniel. We couldn't let your selfishness destroy the cause. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Mm, okay. okay. Go. Hmm? What are we gonna do with all these rabbits? Leave it to me. Uh, is this the life or what? Yeah! Wait, where's Floppy? I made a few calls. Trust me, this won't be the last time we hear about Floppy. Yourself while putting in so little effort. I don't know. It comes naturally. <laughs> that wasn't a compliment. <sighs> Do you realize how lucky you are to have me as your coach? Sorry, Erico. I'll try harder. Football, football, football. Hmm? Squirrel! Hmm. <laughs> 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 That gives me an idea. <laughs> <laughs> Bend your knees. It'll be easier on your inner thighs. Speed, power, I've been watching you. You've got what it takes to be a star. Hmm. Here's my card. Call me if you want to train with a real coach. Hmm? hmm? To work. Can you do me a few kick ups? Okay. <laughs> Did you see that? I beat my record. Okay, see you later. I'm going to go and coach Larry. Huh? What? <laughs> Not now, Cedric. You're going to coach Larry? Well, since you're taking it easy, I figured I could also train someone else. Uh, wait! Wait! I'll start again! I'll try harder! <laughs> <laughs> My plan is working perfectly. I've got a stitch! If you say so. that be? Um... Hey there, Daniel. <laughs> Maple! I'll ask Maple! Maple? You're replacing me with Maple? Okay, you know what? We are done. From now on, I'm going to coach Larry. Oh, yeah? Fine! 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 Hmm. <laughs> um, Maple? Daniel. These potatoes sure are giving me a hard time. Would you like to be my personal trainer? 
Hmm. Look at this squash, Daniel. What do you see? It's smiling? Yeah. The man looks at the squash, and the squash smiles. Take this watering can, Daniel. Wow! I accept to guide you. Does your mom still make that excellent apple pie? Okay, you're in luck. Mm -hmm. My schedule's been cleared. We can start training right away. Come on, 30 laps of the field, 100 push-ups, and 50 pull-ups. Then we start the warm-up. Um, I don't think so. Uh, what? Uh, but, but, um, uh, uh, you don't make the rules. I'm a future star, okay? You can't replace talent. Coaches, on the other hand, poof. Yeah. Okay, what do you want? I might have an idea or two. Um, so when does practice start? Mental preparation is key, Daniel. Oh, right. Quit worrying. You'll stress out the endives. <laughs> I ordered a pony, not a donkey. Put me... Put me through... Settle down, Caramel. Put me through to your manager! Huh? Erico! Ah! ah! Daniel. I, uh, just came to get something out of my locker. <laughs> and, uh, how's it going with Larry? Ah, uh, great. Perfect. He's very receptive. And you with Maple? <laughs> Squashes have so much to teach us, Daniel. Uh, um... Same. Huge mental preparation. Good luck with your donkey. It's not a donkey, okay? It's a pony and his name is Caramel! <laughs> Maple? Coaching is a real job, Dad! Oh, hi, Daniel. I, I was thinking, now that we've spread out the compost and pruned the fig trees, could we work on some passing? Of course. But first, nap time. You must always listen to your biological clock. Huh? <laughs> Whoa! I'm making so much progress with you, Maple! <laughs> Whoa. Right, here's your pony. You like it? Great. Ready to practice now? Hmm. All I'm seeing is a donkey with a ribbon. What I asked for is a pony. Okay, you listen here, Blondie. I'm only gonna say this once. I've never what? seen a... I've never seen anyone improve this fast, champ. <laughs> I'm starting to wonder what you're still doing in this club. <laughs> hmm, now that you mention it... There we go. Daniel? Yeah. <laughs> Erico, I've thought it over. If you'd rather coach Larry, go ahead. But I think we should give it another shot. Oh, I just can't do it. Erico? Yeah? I... I've thought it over and... Daniel, I need to talk to you. Huh? Larry's gonna transfer to a new club and, uh... He asked me to go with him. You, uh, wanted to say something? No, nothing. I hope Larry becomes a great champion. Hmm? Hello, I'm waiting over here. I'm not sure I should just take the number 10 jersey because although there is a one in it, like first, there's also a zero. And as for that, you yeah, know. Ah, uh, Daniel, are you coming? It's time to read to the zucchinis. <laughs> well, somebody seems under the weather. I have... I have a friend who means a lot to me, but... 
But I can't seem to let him know. You can tell your friends anything, Daniel. That's what friends are for. Oh. Thanks, Maple. You really are bad at coaching, but your flat peaches are to die for. They sure are delicious. <laughs> 20 minutes? Oh. Sorry, that's me. I love the violin. Hmm. Well, time to sign the contract. If anyone is opposed to this union, speak now or forever hold your peace. No, oh, Caramel! It's the other way! The other way! You're really sure? Don't complain afterward, it'll be too late. Please, Caramel. It's really important. So lazy, Caramel. Yeah. Hmm? Stop! Daniel? Sisu? Don't do it! I want you to be my coach and no one else! Oopsie. Too late, Sisu. Mm. Hmm? Daniel! Never trust a man in a puffy jacket and loafers. <laughs> Monday, we're gonna start with 10 laps, some kick-up sessions, and then we're gonna work on this right foot. You got it! Uh, do you think we could keep Caramel? Nah, he's only rented. Caramel! So what? So Bada Boom sees that it's getting late and that he has to go to work early tomorrow morning. <gasps> oh no! Bada Boom always does that just before bedtime. Heroes need their sleep too. Have you got Mr. Tickles? Mm hmm. Your water? Mm hmm. Your kiss? Mm hmm. Mwah. Good night, sweetie. A little more? A little less? That's it. Good night, Mom. A little more? Hmm? A little less? Hey, that's not nice, Erico. Life isn't nice, Daniel. Aren't you tired of being such a baby? I am not a baby. You sleep in a onesie. They're very comfortable. How am I going to get my body back if you're still tied to your mother's apron strings? Let's talk about it tomorrow, okay, Erico? It's Betty by time. <laughs> Sorry, Daniel, but you leave me no choice. Uh. What? Erico? What am I doing outside? What's going on? It's time for you to become a man. That's what's going on. What? And there's nothing like a little wilderness experience to make a real man out of you. You can't leave me out here in my pajamas. Real men don't need pants. But I don't have any food. Real men hunt for food. But you're eating my cereal. And I know it's hard to believe, but it's for your own good. You can do it. It's just you and me now, Mr. Tickles. We'll have to fend for ourselves until Mom gets home. But we'll never make it without food. Shades! Hmm. Huh? It's like cereal for birds. Good thinking, Mr. Tickles! Yes! 
Now that's what I call a manly yell. That's a spirit, Daniel! <laughs> Don't move, Mr. Tickles. Hey! Come back here, you thief! So, what's on TV? TV! What are you, hard of hearing? I said, TV! Daniel! TV! Daniel! <laughs> that kid is never around when you need him. Okay, try to look more appetizing, Mr. Tickles. That raccoon won't capture itself. Well done, Mr. Tickles. Hey, Daniel! Hmm? How do you turn on the TV? With the remote. How did you do it before? Lights! TV! Toilet! Ah, so that's why. Multiple traps. Nice work, Mr. Tickles. Now, huh? Daniel! Food! This is Mr. Tickles, and I'm Daniel. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. I have to do everything myself around here. <laughs> Carrots? No thanks. Green beans? Yeah, all right. Broccoli? Seriously? Ah, finally. Food. Daniel, what's up with this pizza? It's all cold and hard. Well, it's frozen, Erico. Oh, okay, Iron Chef. So what do I do with it? Well, put it in the oven. Ah. Uh -huh. In the bathroom? No, the kitchen. Are you sure you don't want me to help you, Erico? Ha! You help me? I'm a man, Daniel. Real men don't need help. Wow, what is that? This is Rascal, my new pal. He taught me to clean myself, to mark my territory, and now we're going hunting! It's Frozen Erico. You want me to help you, Erico? <laughs> Who needs help? I'm a man. So, the oven. Come on, Platana. You're a superstar. Nobody needs to tell you what an oven is, right? That one. <laughs> Easy peasy. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. What am I gonna do with you? <laughs> Oven! Oh no! Daniel! Ah! That kid is never around when you need him! Come on, Platana! Real men always manage on their own! <gasps> Daniel! Daniel! Mr. Tickles! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. 
Erico. Okay, all hmm? right. I can't cook or turn on a TV or a light. Don't wash my clothes. Sort my trash. No, oh, or change a tire. It's good to know how to get by on your own, but knowing how to ask for help when you need it is important as well. I am so glad that you said that, Daniel. Because you're going to need some help to clean up the living room. Hmm? Oh, no! Mommy's going to be so mad at us! Us? Us? I'm just a ball, remember? Mm -hmm. Wow! Look, Erico! Rascal came back with friends to help! We're saved! Wait, are you sure? Okay, everyone! We've got to fix everything up before Mom gets home. a time when a man must take responsibility for his actions. Or find someone else to take the fall. Eh? What? No, we can't do that to Rascal. <laughs> no. No. To think that they forced the French window open with a plastic spade. You were so brave, sweetie. Pizza and cartoons tonight, okay? Mwah. We had no choice, Daniel. Sometimes a man has to cover his tracks. I think I'd rather stay a kid a bit longer, Erico. Door! Door! You have to turn the doorknob, Erico. <laughs> Hang in there, buddy. I'm gonna get you out of there. I've got you a great lawyer. <laughs> What's with all the huffing and puffing? Maple's got some big news. Okay, Hazelnuts. There's gonna be some changes around here. Starting today, it's practice, practice, practice! <laughs> Daniel, am I dreaming? Or are you finally going to play football? We're gonna start with 10 laps of the field, then push-ups, pull-ups, sit-ups, dribbles, passes, penalty shootouts! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Happy birthday, Steven! <laughs> you got me. You really got me. Oh, deep down, I knew it wasn't true. 52 years old? No, oh, that's a cause for celebration. This team is killing me. Football isn't a joke. There's no gain without... Pain. Exactly. Wait, what? Pain. Pain. I don't know, Erico. I don't see anything unusual. Your friend's got a problem, Daniel. Look at her! Pain! But Tomei is always like that. That's her thing. Dark and brooding. Football's a team sport. If one player's got a problem, the whole team's got a problem. Especially if it's the only good player. But... The only good one! So be a proper team captain and go talk to her. Hey, Tomea. Can I sit here? Sure. What's up these days? You good? Yep. You want some cake? Thanks. Well, nice talking to you. Later. Everything's fine, Erico. Tomei is the same as always. Are you kidding? She barely said two words. Yeah, but that's how she is. Quiet and mysterious. So it's worse than I thought. There's nothing to worry about, Erico. I'll prove to you that Tomei is fine. I'll go and make her laugh. <laughs> I'd pay good money to see that. Oh, no. Please don't tell me you're doing the clown. Yep, 
You're doing the clown. Erico, Tamea's not okay. She didn't laugh at a single one of my gags. Not even the surprise tickle attack. Pain! Pain! Maybe we need more clowns. No, Daniel, no more clowns. But, Erico... No! More clowns! You know what makes people happy? Money. When I feel down, I just buy myself something nice and... ka I feel much better. But what would make Tamea happy? I'm telling you, money buys happiness. Just buy her something. And that works? If it doesn't work, just buy something more oh. expensive. Hmm. Tamea Morganson? Yeah. I've got a solid gold watch for you with a diamond bezel and a calfskin bracelet. Will you please sign for it? Nah. What about for the jet ski? Turbo engines and a leopard print paint job with calfskin upholstery. Nah. What about these bags of money? Start her up, Louie. We're sending it all back. My name is Sylvia, but whatever. I don't think she liked our presents, Erico. I told you to get two jet skis. Only cheap skates give one jet ski. I'll call the dealer. No, Erico. We need help. It's time to ask a responsible adult. You did the right thing coming to see me, Daniel. You see, adolescence is like a tightrope strung between you and others. It's not easy to find your balance. Everyone is finding themselves at that age. Even I went through my rocker phase. Believe me, Daniel. The best way to reach Tamea's heart is through her ears. That music is diabolical! Diabolical! Well, I guess we'll have to save Tamea by ourselves. No, Erico, it's not just us. Pain. Well. Tamea needs us, Hazelnuts. We have to cheer her up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If we want to open up a positive, honest conversation, we could just encourage her to talk about her feelings. Or we could just show her cute cat pictures. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We've got to encourage her. Nothing beats a good compliment or two. Right, Junior? Right? Right? Yeah, or we could just give her some space. What about flowers? Everyone loves flowers. Do something nice for her! Chocolate! Call a hypnotist! Wowee! They've got so many ideas! Which one do we choose? We choose all of them. All of them? All of them! All of them? That's crazy! That would be... A, a perfect, perfect day! day. Target is getting close. Everything ready, Daniel? Daniel! You need to say over. Otherwise, I don't know if it's my turn to talk. Over. Duh. Is everything ready, Daniel? Over! Affirmative, Erico. The trajectory is locked. I've got Agents Tiger Lily, Big Daddy, Blondie, and Skinny Steve all in position. Over. <sighs> all right. She just passed the door. Good luck, everyone. Over. Roger. Okay, Tiger Lily. Compliment in. Three, two, one. Hi, Tamea. You look really good today. Thanks. You're up, Blondie. Here, Tamea, I picked you some fresh flowers. Mostly dark roses and black orchids. No, thanks. Chocolates? Not now, Big Daddy. Not now. Not now. Quick, we need to move on. Music, Skinny Steve. We've lost her. Tiger Lily, send in the cats. The cats! Pain. 
It's not working. Code red. I repeat, code red. It's all or nothing now. <laughs> Surprise! We've given your locker a makeover. We've changed your old paint for a tasty new varnish, raspberry colored. And since you like stickers, we've covered your locker with funny, cute ones. Okay, that's it. I'm off the team. What? But wait, we haven't done the dance routine or brought out the cookies yet. Uh, I mean, <laughs> there may be other surprises in store. I'll come back tomorrow to pick up my things. Chocolates? It'll never be the same again without Demea. Might as well stop playing football right now. Chocolates. Eriko, I think we got it wrong. You bet we got it wrong. Cross-eyed cats? Seriously, what was that? Skateboarding cats. Now that's what I'm talking about. Maple was right all along. If we want to reach Tamea's heart, going through her ears is the only way. I know how to get Tamea to come back. Rock and roll. begging you. Anything but that. Huh? Okay. We just wanted to cheer you up so you wouldn't be sad anymore. I'm not sad. Why does everyone think I'm sad? We heard you shouting pain by the trash cans, under the bleachers, in the bushes. Pain is the name of my cat. He ran away. But he came back. Didn't you, Pain? <laughs> oh! Is he a Siamese? No, he's a short-haired Tonkinese. He's adorable! Uh, can you please get changed now? You're making me really uncomfortable. Has the concert been canceled? For Daniel! Hip Hip Hooray! Daniel! <sighs> Your last minute goal won it for us. High five time! High five. High five. High five! High five. High five! Good job, champs. See you at practice on Monday, bright eyed and bushy tailed. <laughs> You did it, Daniel! You scored a goal! Wait, what are you doing? Nothing. I always wash my hands 17 times after a match. Don't you? <laughs> Daniel! Oh. The others were so happy, I didn't want to tell them. I didn't do it on purpose, Erico. I scored the goal with my head! <laughs> yeah? You scored a goal? With my head! What, is that it? <laughs> Listen, Daniel, handballs happen all the time. They do? So I didn't do anything wrong? Everything's okay. Thanks, Eriko. What a relief. Eh? I can't wait to tell Whoa. everyone! Uh, you're kidding, right? But you said everything was okay. Rule number one, if you cheat, no one should know about it. Ever. I cheated? And now I have to lie as well! To everybody, Daniel. You'll see. It's easy. Think of this cupcake as the truth, okay? Put it in your mouth. Oh. Swallow it. And keep it down. Easy, right? Yeah!
It's just jam. No need to worry. <laughs> Somebody knows, Erico. How do you explain all these anonymous letters? And the backyard? And the voicemail messages? I know what you did, Daniel. I know what you did, Daniel. Nah, you're reading too much into it. And that's not all. Mom Shampoo is nowhere to be found. Oh, yeah? Your mom has shampoo. That's, uh, that's funny. I hadn't even noticed. Someone left us these messages! Someone knows about my handball! Ah, oh, kids. Okay, if you insist, we can check the security feed. What? You put cameras up all around my house? Yep, and I put some up at the Stevens house, too. Ugh, back to us. Wait till you see the image quality. A feast for the eyes. See? Nothing. You're imagining things. Wait a sec. Rewind again. Stop! Zoom there! Wait, is that... you? I know what you did, Daniel. I know what you did, Daniel. What? Uh, what? The cupcake has possessed me! It's trying to get the truth out in my sleep. I can't ever sleep again, Eriko. Ever. Oh, Daniel. Relax. We'll figure something out. There's always a way. <laughs> <laughs> Okie doke. You're good. Sweet dreams, Daniel. Sleep tight. Sweet dreams, Eriko. Huh? Daniel? Oh, no. D Daniel! Ninety-nine. Stefan, you really spooked me there. Time to go to sleep now. No, no arguing. <sighs> Good night, Stefan! <laughs> Daniel, but practice is tomorrow, you know. You're nine hours early. I scored with my hand. I'm not worthy. A cheater. My hand. <laughs> I can't understand a word you're saying! One of these days, I'll forget my head. What were you saying, Daniel? I scored with my... my... <coughs> Maple? What am I doing here? I don't know. Were you trying to tell me something? Oh, wow! Was I...? <coughs> well, I, uh... I love your pajamas. Good night. Oh, that's nice. I was worried they were too small. I got them at a thrift shop right near the station and... Well, oh, he's gone. I can't go on like this, Erico. I can't keep the cupcake down. I need to tell the truth. Oh, Daniel. Do you think I would let my best friend down like that? This is my ultra-safe hideout. It came free with the security cams. Huh? Lock yourself in there every night for the rest of your life and bingo. Problem solved. Wow! Thanks, Erico. You really are the best friend I've ever had. Oh, no, no, not the... Hug time! <laughs> That 
smell. Vanilla and cinnamon. <laughs> A delicate hint of lemongrass. <laughs> that smell. Just like Mom Shampoo! <laughs> what? I never stole your Mom Shampoo. No way! Erico? Okay, fine, I stole your Mom Shampoo. You happy now? Do you think I feel better because I told the truth? <sighs> Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do feel much better. I've never felt like this before. You mean you've never admitted to a lie in your entire life? Nope. I lied to my coaches, to my teammates, to my lawyers, to my sponsors. You too, Daniel. Huh? Why did no one ever tell me how good it feels to tell the truth? <sighs> do you think they'll forgive me? Of course they will. It's just one tiny little goal. Huh? Is anybody there? Surprise! Daniel! 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 Congratulations, Daniel. We wanted to thank you for giving us hope again with your miraculous goal. And this is from me. You've really boosted everyone's confidence, Daniel. I did at least two push-ups this morning. And even my dad is cool now. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to you, I've decided to follow my dreams to be the president of the world. <laughs> Thanks a lot, but uh, I have something to tell you guys. Daniel, are you okay? Lights and action. Uh, what I wanted, uh, wanted... What I wanted to say was... I scored the goal with my hand by accident and then we won and I didn't say anything because you were all so happy! Well then, I guess the party's over. Did someone keep the receipt for the apple juice? I lied too. I only did one push up. And I don't actually want to be a world leader. It's too much pressure. I want a simple life. I can't see anything with these shades. Sometimes I listen to world music. I act tough, but I really like you guys. I live in the gym. Uh, yeah, we know. Hmm? We, we lie. Well, thanks, Daniel. The truth has finally set us free. We might not be winners, but at least we're champions at telling the truth. Uh, <laughs> I, I guess. Mm. Feels good, don't it? Sure does. I'll never lie again. Nope, me neither. Was that a lie?